Hello, Divine Feminines! It's time for a reading for y'all. Yay! How many of you viewed the video last night? Sorry about that, but it's just a warning. Don't be a Tanya. People who beat people with lead pipes, you know. Just annoying, really. Alright, Divine Feminines, we're going to see what's going on with you this week. Or whatever, right? So let's see what's happening. What is going on with you this week? As we go on to next week, don't you know that I want... Okay, I'll stop now. Now I'm being silly. Okay, let's see what's going on with you. Ooh, missed an opportunity or just knocking an opportunity away because it's still hard for you to let go of something. It's like you knock that cup over and then bam, it's right fucking in front of you like Transformers or some shit, right? Queen of Cups reverse. Ew. Must be masculine. Ah, uh, then we got Queen of Wands down here. Mmm. Thoughts about somebody who's kind of a fucking snake, honestly. Like, they look good, but they got, like, the whole thing where it's like they're giving you a cup, but it's probably full of poison. Looks sweet, looks kind, looks loving, but at the same time, probably just a smidge nutty. We got the Wheel of Fortune for you. The Knight of Swords Reverse and the Ace of Swords Reverse. My dear feminines, what's your energy? Vibration. Justice. Could be Libra, right? Ew. We got Libra here. We have... Let's see. We got Libra. We got Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Uh, Gemini, Aquarius. My card stuck to the fucking table for no reason. Oh, that's annoying. Um, Aries, Leo, Sag so far. Not a lot of pentacles. Well, we'll see what's coming up with you. It seems like you're dealing with some emotional shit, though. For some reason. Well, we can always figure out the reason, of course, right? But that Ace of Swords is going with this thing. It's like, that bitch is a lie! <laughs> Why do I get away from this deception? You're just having a hard time doing so? I feel like. Hmm. Want to say something about this deception, but you really aren't going to? The wheel's pointing to this one. So that makes me slightly concerned. Like this person's surprised it's gonna land on the heart egg and the little devil dude's gonna drum on it. Moving all the way over to here. <coughs> Fate's turning for him. Right? So let's see what's going on with you, Fems. We got feeling like you're stuck in a loop, and that's why you gave up on shit. Let the opportunity go to be stuck in this loop. Um Ran like the Dickens, I'll say. And, you know, it's still kind of making a wish that the that this shit could have happened, you know. You didn't want to walk away from the cops because it felt like it was way too soon. Right? When I was better to have loved and lost and never loved at all. Like, you still wish for the cycle to still be there because you still got love. Right? And we all know who it's for. But it's like, now you're looking away, being like, where is my love elsewhere? There's gotta be somebody better than this shit. Right? Hmm. Definitely not trying to resurrect anything, because you're cool on your own. Like, no more illusions. That's a good thing. Especially when it comes to all this unfairness and somebody purposely ignoring what is just and is not just. And we got justice right here. So we know where this shit's going. Mm. What you couldn't walk... What's hard for you to walk away from with the other Eight of Cups reverse? Yeah, because it's like you're sitting here wanting to make a wish that you didn't have to let this go. But it's like something's keeping you there. That one fucking cup. Lack of resurrection. 
Like, you don't want to resurrect this shit. You're done. Um, nothing's happening with it, you know? Like, dude's sleeping. Someone does feel like they can't recover. Um, trying to get away without, like, really having any sort of confrontation when it comes to you-know-who. But this could be you trying to go somewhere else to search for that shit silently without saying anything. Might be very quiet with your emotions right now as well. Because there are some things that are just better left unsaid. Um, no reason to keep mourning over something that um, won't come back, right? Just like, you know what? It's better for me not to try to make a decision about the two of us. I'm calm. So the decision really doesn't need to be made. Like, the decision actually brought you a lot more um, clarity and a lot more calmness. But we still got this Ace of Swords right here, and that's annoying. That is so annoying, because it's just like, I know. I know, but you're not letting me know, and that's not cool. Queen of Cups right here in the thoughts and feelings. Um, someone parading like they give a shit with that cup, but it's for ulterior motives, you know, like, uh, what's the best way of putting this? Like, say that there's someone always, like, suck, kissing your ass at work, right? But they only do so because they know how, uh, powerful or whatever you are, right? So they act like they give a shit about you, and then one day you just catch them. You just catch that slip. You catch that slip where you see the real them and you notice that like what they're trying to invest into is just not working for them like the the fruit of the pentacles started rotting before they ever got close to being picked um this person might try to come in for a, a, a argument with you this water sign if you are dealing with one pisces cancer scorpio of course um I feel like this person wants to come in and, and do some shit, but over here, it's like you don't want to even deal with them. It's like they act all kind to everybody else just so you can pick a fight and they're getting agitated. Um, because it's like, you know, you don't even see any reason to fight this person, you know. This person has a volcano. They have problems. They got anger issues. I don't think this is you, Divine Feminine. I think this is people you're dealing with, or a particular person. Could be Divine Masculine, but I don't think it is. Like, the most masculine person here is the Queen of Wands, and I really don't think that that's him. I don't even think that's the Karmic or anything, either. But whoever this person is, is trying to fight you. Um, it's Queen of Wands down here. She feels more bound by herself than anything else. That could be how you're feeling. Feel like you're still stuck out in the cold. That's the mentality behind you right now. And you really don't want to take a leap of faith towards this lack of clarity. You don't know what the fuck could come up because, you know, everything could be caught on fire and then you'll be watching from a distance like, yeah, I'm not going that way. You know, I'm going to sit here and talk to my buff friends. <laughs> you know, they seem a lot more cool. Anyway, um... Okay, let's say this is you, Divine Feminine, this whole row right here. On the inside, you feel like you got to, like, play nice with people. Because, you know, you don't want a confrontation with anybody. But it's like it's not getting you anywhere. And it's really starting to piss you off to where, like, you'll want to fight people. Like, you got a volcano behind you if this is you. If this is somebody else that got a volcano. But it's like these people don't have an ache to fight. And it's just boiling over for you if this is you to be like, you know what? I just, I'm just going to beat your ass. Fuck it. Where this person's like, but I didn't know. I don't care. Say hello when you come into my fucking, like, you know, house or something, you know? And then down here, it's like you're trying to make yourself look good, but you're still hung up on this bullshit over here. Just like, why? Mm. Let's see. Wheel of Fortune. I mean, you look good, you are good, but it's like, uh, Wheel of Fortune, your guard's probably going to come down at some point. The divine timing's going to be kicking in pretty soon. 
Um, soon, in regards of what way, I don't know, because universe soon and human soon are two completely different things, so keep that in mind, please. Um, yeah, you came out pretty fucking rugged, I'd say. You gotta let your guard down, you're coming out of your cave to see the light. Um, your spirit guides are letting you know who is and is not cool, and this is the counterparts of the Queen of Wands right here. You know, this dude's a f asshole, fat, sits on his throne all the time, doesn't even take care of the snakes in his backyard. While over here, it's like you're getting your spirit guides and they're showing you, hey, this dude has abs. He's ripped like Jesus, right? You're already naked. Ride that pony, you know? Like, so we got that going, so that's not too terribly bad. Something new is coming your way, Divine Feminine. So that's good. Last card for this one? Yeah. I think the Wheel of Fortune's turning for you. Because it's been a long trip, I tell you what. Now, this um, Knight of Wands, right? Once again, Queen of Cups Reverse and the Nine of Swords, Sunnyside Reverse. This one's Shadow Side, of course. But it's like she has her back turned! Could be this water sign, or this could be you, Divine Feminine, where someone feels like they have to turn their back because they're as tired of being in the place where they are. It's just kind of like, I gotta keep my mouth shut. Or else, Lord forbid, I, 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 I fuck something up. Like, you gotta turn your back to that which is, um, trying to get under your skin. And you're trying not to go for arguments, right? You know, you're sitting there waiting faithfully for what is that's yours. Ooh, something that might patiently get you somewhere you're wanting to go, business-wise, maybe. And, you know, you're re releasing that old fucking world that's dealing with over here. Um, you might actually start cycling people out. Divine Feminines, you might say that this world that's over here that you had to create in order to survive. Um, you know, like, perspective is key, right? There are some people who, um, much like myself, when we, um, speak, only certain people understand the words that we're actually saying, right? Everybody else is just kind of like, you know, what the fuck did you just say? Wait, I don't understand about the cows and, like, going to college, you know? It's like, you have to know the language in order to, like, be able to communicate with others, and I feel like you're surrounded by people who agitate you because they don't... Not that they don't listen, but that they don't hear what you're saying, and don't take the time to think about what you're saying. And I think that's what's the world that you're trying to escape from right now, because it's like, I'm surrounded by motherfuckers who bore me, and then I just hate the fuck out of me, and just get on my nerves, because it's like, nobody understands you. The only person who did, you know, was a piece of shit, so we won't go there. Um, ooh, Ace of Swords reverse. We got the Queen of Cups once again open with her fucking cup. Before she was up here, reverse. Let's see, we got the Emperor. Ooh. And then we have King of Pentacles. Okay, so like... Hmm. Like, dude's sitting here wondering where you gone. Like, he don't know where he already went to. He's already pissed off. Doesn't want to even want to deal with it. Wants to see where if you're coming or not, but, you know, he's not going to. I feel like what you don't see... Divine Feminine... If you're feeling this way... The truth of the matter is, you're not. Like, you think... Especially with the Eight of Swords down here, that you feel this way. In truth, you're very loving, you're very much in control, and it's like you're gonna get on your pentacles, man. Just gonna take some time. Once again, timing spiritual-wise is much different than human-wise. Right? Right. So. Yeah, Divine Feminines, I feel like you're definitely gonna be going through some... I think you're gonna be going through the motions, the last motions of grief, acceptance. Because that's really what this is more or less about. It's like, 
accepting. It's like you're angry at everything that's happened, but it's like you don't see how far you've come to get to where you were. Like, you feel like you're just being nice to people because, like, you gotta be, but in truth, you are a kind person. You just happen to be a bitch sometimes when people get on your nerves, that's all. Which people do regularly. You know, th th there's no objective difference between that, but that's usually how it goes. Um, I don't think you realize that you're about to get out of this at all. I don't think so. Uh, I think it's just going to take you a lot longer to realize that. Because you're, I feel like you're in a shitty environment. You know, for some of you, um, I feel like the saying, you can't heal where you were injured, um, talks about this a lot. Like, you're still stuck on shit, but you are so blind to what's coming up to you. It's gonna be a fucking surprise. It's gonna be like, ooh, I'm gonna tell my buffalo friends. <laughs> You'd be proud of me. Got fruits and shit, you know? So, that was your reading, Divine Feminines, right? If you enjoyed this video, thank you very much. I appreciate it. You may like, share, subscribe if that's what you wish to do. That is up to you. No pressure, of course. If you want a personal reading of your own, first ones on the house, follow-ups 10, and anything after 20. Right? You guys have a good day, and I will see you later. Bye-bye.